Okay, boys and girls, I'm at uh, Forest Road here, Killbuck Marsh. Hopefully my battery don't go out on me. You got a cross in the sky right next to what is almost the full moon, close enough. Uh, this is Earth Hour, where you're supposed to basically turn off the lights for an hour. I got the night vision set up. I'm going to try to get a view of that uh, cross in the sky through the night vision scope. Uh, being a pain. I got it on a tripod for the first time ever. Got to unlock it. We'll move it around a little. Uh, there we go, kind of. It's a very, very cool looking cross. There you go. The lower I get it, it, it seems like it's a little too high. Um, maybe on my uh, tripod. I'll lower it some. See how that works. I'm just gonna function more. Mm. The cross is floating, so it's getting closer to the moon, which then uh, the night vision isn't doesn't do that great when it's near a heavy light source. But you kind of can see it. It's pretty cool looking. Uh, very, very cool cross in the sky. Very, very cool. See, the lower I bring it, uh, below the moon, but it's it's drifting because it, there, these two jets just flew and they crossed their uh, oh, calm trails or whatever you want to call them. It's very, very awesome. It is so beautiful out here tonight. Compared to Friday night when I got here, it was freezing. Um, I'm, I'm where basically beyond where the bridge is fenced off. I found out why. It's not to keep people off. Oh no, it's to keep people that are that bright from driving on here. You have to be out of your mind to be driving on this. But that is just a cool um, artistic view in the sky tonight. It's it's very, very beautiful. Pure, uh, pure, pure uh, awesomeness. Pure love right there. Unfortunately, batteries are going to go down on me, and I have no idea where I put my uh, backups. Oh, I got them in my pocket. Duh. Yeah, I'm always prepared. Always be prepared, like the, <laughs> the Boy Scout motto. I could go into why I didn't get a B in the Boy Scouts. I had to go to religious classes. <laughs> Interesting. It's beautiful out here. And that, that cross is just floating across the sky. It's very, very cool. Let's see if I can see it without the... See, it's slowly going away from the moon, so you really can't see it. There's the moon up there. There's some beautiful stars over here. Not sure if you can even see those. That's another jet there. No beaver show. I don't know why. Out of all the years I've been here, well, at least the last couple of years, there's been a beaver hanging out. Right in this area, I was hoping to get some footage with the night vision, but they were here last night briefly, but I don't know. This is very, very cool. It's a great shot. I'm known for getting really good uh, video shots. I was known at the Nature Center for it. Known at the video school at Scarred Oaks for it. And some people say on YouTube. I just, I have an amazing eh, ability to be at the right place at the right time. I think that might be another jet coming through, or a star. Very, very, very cool. I am exhausted. My legs are actually shaking. Well, I'm standing in a demented lower position too because of this horrible tripod. It's supposed to be a good tripod. But, 
I bought it from the Amish <laughs> up here a few years ago. Just one of them happened to break. I, I probably my manhandling of tools. I use and abuse tools like you cannot believe. I'll close this puppy down.